This is how to set up a fish tank by Michael Coughlin. This is uh, your proof that I do know how to set them up. This is a 75, it's a 30, it's a 20. I have a terrarium right now, right there. It's a 2.5 gallon. I have my 55 that is divided, got my other stuff in it. So, you're gonna start off with your empty tank. This right here is a 10 gallon, just like that other 10 gallon down there that is not set up right now. You start off with your 10 gallon. See that very, you're gonna add your gravel. I washed this gravel off and cleaned it off because it was actually already in there before. So, I have to dress my gravel right here. Dump it all in there. All your gravel's in your tank. You need to smooth it out. So you get back. An inch or whatever. Supposedly, you just want Alright, your third step is you want to add your filter. My filter. A little filter. It just hangs off on the side right here. Like that. Oops. Where you got your tank, your gravel, and your filter on it. Doesn't really matter where you want to place your filter, unless you're going to put a lid on it, and I would suggest placing it on the back of your tank. You're going to add your heater. This is just a normal 10 gallon heater. You're just putting it on the back so your cord can get out of the water, uh, out of the back, or you can just plug the filter and the cord in at the same place. Because your lid's going to be on there too, and you'll see why the lid is going to help also. So, got your filter here. Next part, you want to get your lid. You buy, this is for 10 gallon right here. What I'm going to do, set it right on the fish tank, like so. Make sure the light cord is back out of the way of the filter so it doesn't get any water and get anything electrocuted. And that's, this is why you really want to have your cords out the back because you can't really put them in there. You're going to want to put water in your tank so you can either do it by using a usual bucket from a hose or you can just take your hose since i'm in the basement you can just take your hose right out from outside and pull it right in the house up through the window and then basically you're just going to add so let me try and get this set up here real fast for you. You wait a couple weeks, like two, I want to say two weeks, three weeks. You want to either get, after you get it tested and stuff at feeders, because they test for free, that's where I got mine all tested. You want to get some fish called black shirts or other hardy fish like zebra danios. You're going to just take your fish that you get, you're going to actually want to, from the bag, you want to keep them in the bag, stick them in the water. Or Walmart wherever you buy your fish actually this one is leaking so you're gonna stick it in your fish tank like that and just leave it in there for about up to 20 minutes so they so you don't shock them immediately into their water and then you're gonna once you once they get done you can just open the bag and just let them go into their tank there you go and then that's the end of your fish tank. You have it set up. You got some fish in it and everything. I put a little decoration in there for right now because they like to hide behind it. So that's so that's the end of how to set up your fish tank for fish tank. Bye.